or one 2,000 pound torpedo. Obviously, the name is Torpedo Bomber. Here it is from the right to the left. It's being flown by Bill Shepard. Bill comes all the way from Ontario, Colorado, California, whatever, Canada, Canada, got it right, just to fly for you today. This is the TBM Avenger. It's got a R2600, 14 cylinder, 1900 horsepower Curtis Wright engine. Rob made a comment about how much good about gas mileage he gets in his RV. Well, I guess we're a little bit jealous of that. We do carry 325 gallons of fuel, but we only get about one to two gallons a minute burn on this aircraft, so our range is limited. It has a wingspan of 54 feet. It's capable of 267 miles an hour. But when I mentioned the 54 feet wingspan, we can pull the wings down to 20 feet, which makes it a very good, or at least it's uh, compatible to be handled on an aircraft carrier. Speaking of an aircraft carrier, this type of airplane, as well as many other World War II aircraft, were capable of landing on what we called a Jeep carrier. Jeep carrier, which was kind of a support carrier carrying extra aircraft out into the Pacific, but it became a tactical aircraft carrier as well. The length of that flight deck basically was 500 feet. Today they're over a thousand feet, they're quite wide, they're angle deck, and all the current technologies that go with it. But try, try to imagine bringing an 18,000 pound aircraft doing 70, 75 knots and landing it on a posting stamp, a pitching deck in the Pacific. Here it comes left to right, As I said, this aircraft was developed in the mid, right after uh, first saw duty, right after World War, uh, excuse me, after Pearl Harbor. There you can see the bomb bay open, which it did not drop a 2,000 pound torpedo, but certainly was capable of that. Right after Pearl Harbor, the United States struck back in various reasons. And one of the battles was the Battle of Midway. During the Battle of Midway, there were six of these aircraft launched to, to attack the Japanese carriers in the area. It's sad to say that five of those six 